Hello, my name is Neil Tickton. I'm the Editor-in-Chief and Publisher of MacTech Magazine. We are here today doing the TUAW MacTech Magazine interviews of developers at WWC 2011. Joining me now is Alexander Kosovan from MacPaw. Welcome. Yeah. Thank nice you for coming. You. And, um, why don't we start off with, tell us a little bit about yourself and MacPaw, and let's get a little bit of background on, on what you guys do. So I'm the founder of MacPo, mm -hmm. and I'm the creator of Clean My Mac, our main utility. Uh, this is ba basically a system tool that helps users to save a lot of space, mm -hmm. clean up junk, and speed up system performance. Great. And uh, we also developed some other tools like Ansel, MacIder, but uh, our main tool is Clean My Mac. Okay. So uh, Clean My Mac is has how long has it been shipping? It's been shipping uh, for a little while now. Yeah, it? it's more than three years. Three already. years. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and uh, the, the best way for people to, to think about uh, Clean My Mac is that it's a way for them to make their system just be cleansed of a lot of the, of the items that, would, uh, that need to be taken off of the cache files or, or different types of, of, uh, of, of software that's gotten left over from people. Or Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yeah, we, we really, really help people a lot to, uh, to clean up uh, their system, for example. Uh, when you remove an application, we can uh, detect that and clean up. Uh, All the extra pieces uh, of the application that uh, yeah. may have gotten left over. Yes. Yeah. And, yeah. Great. Uh, Besides, even if you already removed the application without right. Clean My Mac, we can find those leftovers and uh, also help users to find and to remove them. Great, great. So, um, did you get a chance to, to watch the keynote? Yeah, uh, I was yeah. really pleased that Steve was able to come. There you go. So, tell us a little bit about what you thought about the announcements made at the keynote. Uh, there are, there are really good features uh, like iCloud, for example. Yeah. Uh, it may be not so relevant for users because uh, they don't see the, big, the background of it. it. It just works for them. Right. Uh, but for developers, it uh, saves a lot of uh, efforts on the uh, system they have to support. For example, uh, if you're developing a multi-platform application like like things, for example. Right. Uh, they have been, have been trying to create their own cloud solution for right, about right. a year right now. Right. And uh, it becomes a lot more easier right now to uh, to do this just because... Do, they just use Apple's iCloud work, and yes. they won't have to worry about it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And this is really great. It will save a lot of money for the developers. Right. So um, anything specifically with what MacPaw is doing right now do you, that you see in affecting the way you guys do development or do you see uh, opportunities here from what Apple uh, talked about for your software? Do you see challenges for, for your software? Yeah, we see a lot of opportunities in those ch challenges. For example, uh, with version support or up to save feature, uh, it uh, will definitely take a lot of space on the user's mach machine, and this is where, where we can help. Okay. And uh, we will be orienting our next version of Clean My Mac uh, for Lion, it's, it's for sure. <laughs> So what you'll be doing is, is will you be taking, uh, having Clean My Mac, take a look at four of the different versions that, that are saved in Lion with the new features of, of saving all these versions that go back and helping them to clean up those versions and to remove them? Or, or are you in, in free up space in that way? Or are you thinking of something different? Uh, we really don't have the solution right now, but uh, I think uh, there will be a lot of opportunities in, in this direction for okay. us. And... Uh, I disagree. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, is there anything else you want to tell us about what you're doing with MacPaw, or, or any of the of, of the things that you've heard around WWC, or anything that uh, gives you an idea as to more opportunities for people to take a look at? Uh, besides versions, uh, I think people will install more and more uh, applications to try uh, through the uh, Mac App Store, right. and uh, uh, also people will f forget, for example, uh, about application that he installed uh, a month ago, for example, right. and uh, also a lot of opportunities for us here because we can help to manage that easier. That's great. That's great. Great. Well, uh, Alexander, it's a pleasure having you here. I'm glad it's a long way from home for you, but yeah. uh, I, uh, it's a pleasure having you here, and we're glad that you could join us. Uh, my name is Neil Tickton. I'm the editor-in-chief and publisher of MacTech Magazine, and we're here doing the MacTech Magazine TUAW interviews of developers at WWC 2011. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs>